हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी टेलिंग यू दैट हाउ टू कन्वर्ट योर एच टी एम एल टू पी डी एफ डॉक्यूमेंट इज यूजिंग द जे एस पी डी एफ एंड एच टी एम एल टू कैनवस लाइब्रेरी इन साइड एंगुलर नाइन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू नीड टू इंस्टॉल दीज लाइब्रेरीज बाई एग्जीक्यूटिंग वेरी सिंपल कमांड विच इज एन पी एम इंस्टॉल जे एस पी डी एफ एच टी एम एल टू कैनवस डैश डैश सेफ सो बेसिकली इट विल इंस्टॉल इट एज अ डिपेंडेंसी इन साइड योर एप्लीकेशन आई हैव ऑलरेडी डन दैट सो आई विल नॉट डू इट अगेन सो जस्ट मूव टू योर एप डॉट कंपोनेंट डॉट एच टी एम एल फाइल एंड हेयर यू जस्ट नीड टू क्रिएट अ सैम्पल एच टी एम एल फाइव डॉक्यूमेंट एंड चेंज दिस टाइटल टू एच टी एम एल टू पी डी एफ इन एंगुलर नाइन एंड वी विल ऑल्सो बी मेकिंग यूज ऑफ सम काइंड ऑफ बूट स्ट्रैप सो यू जस्ट नीड टू इंक्लूड द बूट स्ट्रैप सी डी एन सो आई विल जस्ट कॉपी पेस्ट द सी डी एन हेयर लाइक दिस एंड आफ्टर दैट जस्ट मेक ए लिंक टैक हेयर and copy paste the href and now inside this we will have a heading which will have a class of uh, this will be alert alert info and inside this we will have uh, html to pdf like this and after that we will copy paste the table bootstrap table which we will be converting here you can convert any sort of html document but i will be taking as as example of html table so now i also need to give it a separate id so basically whatever element that you want to create it as a pdf or take a screenshot with the help of html to canvas library you should be giving at a unique id i have given this id as a table and now basically i need to go to app dot component dot uh, uh, ts file now let me just delete all the code from here and uh, first of all we need to Uh, include these dependencies right here at the top let me just show you step by step so this will be import at the rate js pdf from js pdf and second library we will import is html to canvas from html to canvas and now after this we will write our basic function which was there i think that we i didn't include the button so just after the table we will have a button which will say to us that uh, download pdf and we will bind a on click event listener to it so when we click this button we will execute this function which will be download and now basically we will create this function here inside this like this download and uh, now we will be first of all be getting the element by document dot uh, get element by id and we the id that we have given to the table is table after getting the table we can just use the html to canvas library pass the element and now it will return a we need to catch it by the dot then and now it will return a canvas element that we can just catch here like this so basically it has taken the screenshot and now it has stored the reference inside this canvas element and now basically uh, if i just show you if i just console log it console log canvas and basically it is just uh, compiling the application and now it is complete you will see that this is our application if i click if i right click inspect element and uh, if i go to console here download pdf so basically it will give me this element which is canvas width 764 height 343 all that stuff and now we just need to get the picture so how we can get the picture it is very easy first of all we just need to have the image data so which is canvas dot to image url so basically we will use this function to data url and here we will pass the extension of the image which is image slash png we will convert it to a png image using html to canvas we will take the screenshot like this and now basically we will be creating a new instance of js pdf and then after that there is a method inside this which is add image like this so with the help of that you can just pass our image data like this and after that you also need to provide the x and the y position so this will be 0 comma 0 and the image height will be 208 comma 
uh, the image height let's suppose I give it 500 and then lastly we can save the document as uh, image dot PDF like this so now basically let me just show you if I reload the application download PDF so now it will download this as as a image dot PDF you can see that if I open this you will see that it, it has taken the screenshot uh, and screenshot of the table and uh, it has successfully converted it the I think that the height is not proper so for the height let me just show you the height also so basically in order to calculate the height we will use this uh, statement which is there inside this let me just copy this the width is 208 that is constant but for the height we will be creating a function just for this image height this will be canvas dot height multiplied by image width so image width is 208 I will just here divided by canvas dot width so basically I will pass this as a variable like this image height and now basically you will see that it, it, it will be aligning the picture in a more reasonable manner if I reload the application once again if I download PDF and now if I open the PDF document you will see the table in a more reasonable manner it is aligning per perfectly so now basically this is a perfect application that we have created you can take any screenshot of any HTML document inside this application in angular 9 so this is a very easy way that you can just convert HTML to PDF using angular 9 so thanks very much for watching this video and please 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 hit the like button in uh, near the bottom of the video if you like this video please support me by hitting the like button and also subscribe the channel and don't forget to hit the notification bell icon and I will be seeing you in the next video